Hello, I am doing an old explorer deck now. I just want to try a mono explorer. I think it would be fun. So as you can see, I'm running Joe, XB, and ZF. <laughs> there aren't that many explorer types, uh, but I think these are some good ones to run and stuff. Now I can run the explorer type beef, but I don't really think it's like, uh, like, okay, it wouldn't be bad to run because at the end of the day, it deals 100 damage, it's 40, all that stuff. But, but the problem is that I don't know if it's worth it, especially because it takes up an ultra rare slot where it wouldn't be that big a deal if I was taking advantage of the NHO ability, but I'm not. So it taking up an ultra rare slot is an ultra rare slot that can go to an ultra rare item, which would be better, I think. Not much else to say, let's just play. We're going up against Ben. Good old Ben, 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 oh, I, I know Ben. We go way back and, oh, I don't remember Ben. I don't remember you playing with TFC. Ah, uh, you, you should have told me the last time we hung out. Okay, I'm done. I'm gonna stop. <laughs> um, okay, everything is good. I could immediately start using Get Dangled. I kind of want to use Sheep Stare, though. I will put on the times two, though, just in case I want to be using the stronger ability, or I mean the more damage ability. Oh, I have Fishing Rod. Oh, and I also have Clock. I'm gonna Fishing Rod. I think that's better. Oh, it short, whatever. And I'm gonna actually sheep stare. Oh, it, I got tails. I was hoping, I want the SA to damage itself. And turn, ooh, awesome, we got AXP. I would like to at least play with all three of the hermits I put in my deck. Why they get to draw, they got heads, but I don't, what is this favoritism and totally not just normal probability? What the heck? What the heck? Well, maybe the double should have gone to XB. That's all right. I, um, well, we could do, we can, you know what we can do? We can do the clock, which is a great thing to do. So I'm gonna use the clock. Do you want the plies? Yes. And then I attack. I'm gonna sheep stare again. Heads, 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 damn. Yeah, and turn. Then it's my turn again. Awesome. Then we're gonna use TNT and we're gonna sheep stare again. I will get the sheep stare to work at some point. Whoa, I got it to work. Okay, awesome. Oh, I forgot to put the item card on XP. That's right. Wait, so how does this work? So I got the head, so TSC should do damage to itself. Okay, he did. He didn't switch over though oh i just realized they leaded away my thing well too bad for you i have another double card and you just made my xp work right now so it that sucks for you oh that's just a that's just a kill right there oh don't mind if i do iron armor oh we got a lead a bow no <laughs> You can't hurt my AXP. They're AFK. They're sleeping right now. Well, okay, sleeping's an actual thing in the game, but they're AFK right now. That's not cool. Not cool at all. Right, I'm gonna put the iron armor on my EXP, my XP. What? It, whatever. And then we'll use a lead. We'll move over the double item card. I know it still helps this TFC, but it means that they can't use the full power this turn right away. It might delay full power for a bit. So that's kind of the main reason. And then I will just deal the 80 damage. Oh, they keep trying to just hurt my XP. XP hasn't even come online yet. And you're trying, that's so mean. A AFK, attacking an AFK player. How cruel is that? I would never, I would never do that. And there is no video evidence of me doing so. None. <laughs> Uh, I think it's worth using composter on these two item cards. I, uh, that's fine. Okay, good. They didn't actually have another item card for TSC. Ooh, that's good. That buys me some turns and turn. Well, I, I got it. The, my explorer item cards back, which is all good. Uh, they find, they did get another item card and they swapped. That's fine with me. That's fine. Well, obviously, this means I should use I should use Sheep Stare, of course, right? Let's use Sheep Stare. <gasps> it worked. Oh my gorb. Now TFC will deal 90 damage to themselves. Does that mean I take damage still when they attack, or I don't remember how that works? 
Oh, I forgot. It's two coin flips. I forgot. Two coin flips. Whoops. So the second coin flip failed and ZF took a lot of damage. Oh, well. Good thing I have a chorus fruit. Mmm. That would be good. I don't think there's anything super worth getting in the chest. Or is there? Hold on. Wait, no. I want a chorus fruit. Let's not waste my uh, single use. So we'll place course for it. We'll attack with just, let's just do get dangled for some guaranteed damage. And then we'll swap over. Yes. And end torn. Ooh, golden apple. Wait, I can heal that up. I can heal that up. That would be so good. Other gold. How dare you? You're, I am allowed to have golden apples, but you're not, of course. Duh. Obviously. Should I use it? Actually, I might want to use it on, <laughs> on XP. XP is taking a lot of damage. Uh, XP, you are safe. And XP, deal damage. Noise. And torn. Oh, more healing. Awesome. I gotta love the healing. <gasps> My armor. How will I protect XP now? You monster. How could you? Oh, hey, Joe. Oh, no. Oh, no. No, 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 no. Okay, well, let's put Joe on there. And I will heal. Is this the right move? Because they might have another item to deal more damage. I don't know. But I'm going to heal. And I don't care. Dum -ba -dum -ba -dum. Because they might be too scared now. Okay, they definitely can't apply healing now because they use the chest. But they might swap now. Because if they don't, well, their TSC dies. Ooh, are they going to swap to Hypno? No. Wait. They are keep... Wait, they're gonna sacrifice TFC in twisting so that they can deal some damage. Fair enough, fair enough. Uh, well, let's get, ooh, there's healing, 100 HP heal, or an extra turn. I think an extra turn's more worth it. Let's get back ourselves the clock. I feel that's more worth. Okay, now I can kill the TFC. But then I will just die back from, well, yeah, their TFC can do enough to, yeah, I could, I will just die right back, which is the conundrum. And I think that was their big brain move they're having right there. So yeah, I guess I will just switch over to Joe. It is Joe time. Oh, hey, we got another XP. Cool. Their Hypno is very dangerous though, because if they get Hypno up to two item cards, then he can start sniping my AFK guys, which is really really LP. Okay, well not super LP, but it's just good, especially in these circumstances. Oh no, I just realized they leaded me again. They moved away. Oh, now only Joe can howdy. How sad. Joe can only howdy. Well, too bad for you. I will kill your TFC today. Your TFC will die. And turn. Oh, look, it's my turn again. Oh, what is this? Oh, we will attack and you are now dead. I got their TFC, which does not help at all because I have no cobblestone. I was for a moment, I was like, oh my God, I would love to branch mine, but I have no cobble to support it. Oh yeah, it's still my turn. Whoops. We got another XP. I will wait before putting this on the board because there's no reason. Oh, they're sniping away. Oh, they sniped that one away. Fair enough, fair enough. Okay, their Hypno doesn't have their ability got him ready yet so that's good but still very dangerous i don't know if i should be bothering putting more stuff on joe i'm gonna put stuff on my xp right now and i'm gonna go for a lot of damage <laughs> with joe whether that was the right move or not i do not know they're taking it a while to decide what they're gonna do which fair enough I, they did just okay. I didn't realize that was a full-on kill. That makes sense actually, and that makes me very sad. I uh, yeah, we'll go to that one. Oh, I did not mean to put TFC out there. I meant to put a XP. You, you know, both cars they look kind of similar. You know, there there there's reason to to understand why. You you know, I and we attack with seventy, and uh, it's gonna take two turns to kill their hip now. Oh. We'll play one more game. Just one more. Anyway, starting with Zedaf, and it's also our turn. So we'll put Zedaf out there. And all we have are item cards, which is not so good. Um, and Torn. 
I only got another hermit. That's good. That's good. Oh, I do not like the sign of that. They're gonna try. Oh my god, they're using poisoning. Wait, they're using poisoning and and burning. Th this feels like the first deck I played with in my first video, where I just had a bunch of uh, burning ethos and a bunch of poisoning exumas and some other stuff. But that's a lot of hermit on the board. Well, I'll put out my Joe, my good old Joe. Get Dangle's already online, so we'll not worry about that. Wait, I wonder if okay. Hold on. If theoretically uh, Sheep Stare succeeded and got Azuma to hurt itself, and, and Azuma had two item cards attached, so it would do Cup of Tea. Does it do Cup of Tea to itself or just the 80 damage? Because if it does Cup of Tea to itself and then rolls heads, would it then poison itself? These are the important questions we need to ask. I need to ask. Not important. Okay, right, let's just attack. I will. No, I'll just do get dangled, honestly. I'll just do that one. Aw, oh, come on, really? Armor? Oh yeah, I didn't get poison, that's good. But now the right armor? Come on. All right, well, not much else to do other than the obvious of putting item on Joe. Oh wait, hold on. Opponents forced to discard their active Hermit's attached effect card. They, oh my God, this actually came in handy. I love this, yes. Yes, 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 yes. Oh boy, I that was great. I love that. I right, uh, get the angle, cheap stare. Hmm, I can. I'm gonna gamble. I'm gonna risk it for the biscuit, and I'm gonna do that. Oh, I got a head. So hopefully on their turn, if it's a head, then I will get lucky. Come on, hoping, hoping for a heads on their turn. So they pull out a tango. Now are they gonna attack? Are they gonna switch? Wait, if they switch, does Zeta's Sheep Stare still go off? I think it does, right? Oh, it went off. Okay, wait. Okay, so adult... Okay. Hold on, judge. Judge, judge. Can I get vintage beef here? Judge, 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 judge. I'm calling judge. Um, I, I'm gen generally just curious because I don't know how like beef intends this interaction to work or re like whatever and and i know it's like the website's not perfect um either so if beef does intend it the way i'm assuming i would think it would be potentially intended but maybe not i don't know i'm just curious uh so my my sheep there did go off exuma took damage but but then their coin flip went off but i took the poison I fully accept and I'm okay with with Azuma not taking their own poison, but I still get poison. That seems that seems kind of lame, mainly because it's affecting me right now. Hey, <laughs> right, um, but yeah, I'm genuinely curious, so I will just leave it up to that, and I will just kill their Azuma. Hey, look, another is that off. Oh, come on, they have the other Azuma online now, or uh, like full up on items. And they've, they doubled poison to me. How dare. I right, well, Zedoff is going to die regardless. So there's no point in switching out either because Zedoff is just going to die. So no better way to than to go out with a bang, I would say. Oh, wait. Let's put this item card on here. I forgot. And let's get this out. And we're going to go out with Zedoff in a bang. We're going to TNT 40 or 140. And that was great. And torn. More Zedafs. We're just gonna have all Zedafs. Zedafs across the board. Zedaf everywhere. I feel like this is an easy... Oh, okay. You're still thinking... Oh, you... Oh, okay. I don't know what I'm thinking. Okay, they got me out. They got their little bonus prize card. Hopefully it wasn't a good card for them. Cool, cool. So I will switch into my Jove course. We'll put this on that. And I guess we'll put out the other Zedaf for now. Okay, wait. Let's do some quick math. So... Wait, I can just kill their Azuma. Let's kill their Azuma. Let's go. This is going really well. Oh my god. So, well, don't forfeit, please. Don't forfeit, please. I want to actually see it go through. Now, if the, if this was happening, like, in person on the Hermitcraft server, I don't consider it forfeiting if it gets to a certain point to where they're just like, oh, that's just game. Uh, because they're not being like, I quit or something. Or, I don't know. Because... I. Because there's still a lot of game left and opportunity for things to happen. But if it's like literally towards the end of the game and they literally have the opponent has 
no other options no matter what they will end up dying especially like next turn or something uh, like if they if it basically if you do something and then what it passes turn to the to the planet or whatever and they literally can't do anything then i'm just calling it there being like that's game you won i don't consider that forfeiting especially when it's like on like irl irl on the hermocraft server but any other circumstance of you just being like i give up that is forfeiting i think does that make sense i don't know also they burned my joe how dare you burn my joe my my joe how dare uh let's go looking for tnt sure why not <laughs> and let's attack for high q of a 90. And since, oh, you apply the di- oh, I don't have another book to get rid of your armor. But you apply diamond, okay, that's good. I just need to kill one more. Uh, your hats mean nothing anymore. Okay, Joe's gonna go out with a bang regardless, so there's no point in course reading because the burn's gonna kill Joe off AFK regardless. So might as well do some more damage, you know, you know? There you go, so I should- oh no, because of the diamond armor, I won't even be able to kill with anyone next turn. Damn. Damn. Um, I end torn. This is actually a close game because we both are left at one heart. So that's something. Joe. Oh, I have to bring someone in. Uh, I pick this Zedath. This one. Then we'll bring in Joe. Oh, Joe can actually wait. Yeah, I can actually put the redstone card they gave me on the Joe. That's good. The only thing I can do is sheep stairs. So hopefully that works out. Oh, heads, if we get lucky, uh, Etho will knock himself out next turn, I think. Oh, actually, no, wait, yes. Etho will, if I get lucky with the heads, Etho will knock himself out next turn. So that would be, oh, that would be so good if, if it's a sheep stare win. That would be amazing. I would love that. Oh, no, they're using the clock, but the, but the heads thing still works, right? No, it won't go off even if they switch. Hold on. So if they switch, they get to ignore the sheep stare. Oh wait, no, they don't. I got so confused. Okay. Oh wait, is it next attack? Hold on. Flip a coin if heads opponent flips a coin their next turn. Okay, no, it has nothing to do with that. Okay, whatever. So that happened. I will get an XP out because why not? And I will just attack. It's going to take two turns to kill, but whatever. Nope. <laughs> I mean, if I got let go of the sheep stare again and got lucky lucky, then maybe either would hurt himself but he does not my turn again let's use my other chest and let's just end this let's just end this next turn guaranteed because he might swap oh wait no it won't be guaranteed oh my god i don't know wait heads okay wait this could end this could potentially end oh heads it ends it's over etho wait oh no it's tango i'm so dumb Hold on, I thought it was still on Etho for some reason. Why did I think that? It's not over. I'm dumb. As always. <laughs> oh, come on. And their Tango now has the diamond armor. Fun. Okay, well, I'm going to TNT it up because that's always fun. Heads, heads. Okay, okay, cool, cool. And turn. Yes, Zedoff got heads. Oh, that is so good. Awesome. Okay, we're going to fishing rotted up see what we get finally damn okay um i think i am actually better off still doing sheep stare i'm gonna actually build up joe some more okay listen here's what i'm saying because okay if i do get dangled uh because of the diamond armored it's not gonna kill tango but and so take two turns regardless but if i use sheep stare there's a chance that Tango takes himself out, potentially. Although he can just switch, and I think that negates that potentially. I don't know, whatever. I do think Sheep Stare is the better option right now. So we will Sheep Stare. I'm getting good draws or good flips, good good coin flips. Where was the where were these good coin flips when I was playing a coin flip deck? Come on. Where 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 was it? Where where were they? Oh, they lead it. That's what happened. I was like, what's going on here? <gasps> Tango hurt himself. Ah, oh, that's great. I love it. That's so good. Oh, okay. So when it hurts themselves, the armor still apply. They forbid. They forbid. Jibid. Wait, no. I think that's fair because i think i would have just killed them next turn either that or maybe they i don't know 
I guess you could let me know if technically it would have been game over my turn for them. So I don't know. But thank you so much for watching. That was a fun deck. Just full mono explorer type. That was fun. Check out my other videos if you enjoy my content. Because if you did, then I guess there's more content you would probably maybe enjoy. Subscribe too. It, it does help. If, or I mean, you don't have to. I'm not holding a gun up to you or whatever. So uh, you have full autonomy. You have free will. I can say words. Uh, do whatever. And I'll see you later. Maybe. Bye.